Hey everyone, today I'm going to take a look at Animal Warriors of the Kingdom Cardoon. Am I pronouncing it right? I don't know. So, this is the training, the trainer of House Verilis, uh, which is the cat kind of house. Yeah, I know, my, my, my uh, <laughs> Animal Warriors of the Kingdom knowledge is a little weak. I uh, need to reread the comics a little bit to get the familiarity of the houses and everything but I, overall i do like the figure i have a few complaints and i'll get to them in a minute uh but first let me tell you about some of the things i like the armor is really cool i do like that it's uh dual colored instead of single colored like uh, most of uh, the figures are they go in a certain pattern and this one kind of goes into asymmetry which i do dig i really think that's a really nice touch to uh give it some give it something a bit different now i thought initially it was designed that he could hold his bow on his back while he had his swords looks like you just kind of sling it in to the straps and kind of hope for the best i keep feeling like that's going to break though so i'm not going to do it pretty regularly now and as far as accessories go yeah i've got one complaint He's got the same swords as Kali. And, you know, the thing is, I really like these swords, but I, I think they belong to Kali. Uh, they don't belong to anyone else. And because of that, I'm kind of like looking at it going, oh, man. Would you have given him some other swords or some other weapons just to make him less, just to make Kali's more unique? And I do get reused in a line. I don't mind reuse. They could have, there's a, several weapons they could have reused but these swords to me i i, I kind of like them being exclusive with the kali um you know those curved blades i mean they're cool blades i like them i just don't like them spread out over the line like that i i would prefer them to be you know held back i mean the bow is generic enough i mean it's been in the line before and that's fine i dig it but yeah that's my one gripe is that these swords i just think they belong to another character and just stay that way. Now, I might be a little weird like that. I mean, sometimes I think some weapons need to stick with one character. And that's it. But, you know, I do have a few extra weapons from the other figures I might trade out and give to him. Uh, there's that cool mace. Uh, since I'm not using it with um, Tiberius, I might give that to... Uh, Cardoon, I think that might work. And beyond that, I mean, everything else about the figure is pretty, pretty cool and pretty standard. I mean, at this point, we know Animal Warrior of the Kingdom's articulation, double jointed uh, knees and arms, and you know, basic uh, shoulders that go all the way out, uh, the ab crunch, the uh, excellent uh, feet, the soft. The softer plastic on the uh, overhang on the feet to allow for more movement. There's not a whole lot you can add to this. Uh, that This is the figure. The head scope looks really good. I mean, it's obviously a cat creature. But still, he has enough uniqueness in him that it's not rehashing. And you don't feel like you're getting the same figure. Now, there's reuse in this figure. And it's, it all works just fine. And, you know, again, reuse in an action figure line is necessary sometimes. And this uh, nails reuse without uh, it looking like reuse. The paint is, of course, Im just impeccable. And, of course, there's sheen on the right spots in the armor just to make it just pop just a little bit and to make it work really, really well. Love it. So while I would give this one my least favorite of Animal Warriors of the Kingdom, I will say I really like it. I'll give it four stars. It's a really awesome figure. Really awesome addition to the armies of Animal Warriors of the Kingdom. I would say get it as soon as you can. It's really awesome. The This line is just has set the bar so high that, you know, this excellent figure is like lower than the rest of them i mean it's that damn good i really like it 
uh, I really dig this this line so so much. I can't say enough about it. It really just really just impresses me on every turn. Uh, if you've not gotten into Animal Warriors of the Kingdom, I highly suggest you do. These are some fantastic action figures, and the concept behind them is really, really good. So, that's my review of uh, Cardoon and uh, Animal Warriors of the Kingdom. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to Robert's Infinite Realms, that's me, Robert, and, uh, you know, tickle the bell icon so you get uh, all the notifications. And thank you for watching. You have a great day.